And in a throwback to the bad old days of the 70s and 80s, the West Village has now become overrun with graffiti and garbage. CBS2 political reporter Marcia Kramer demanded answers and got action, at least when it comes to the garbage. This driver thought he had it bad when he had to step over a pile of uncollected garbage in the West Village to reach the parking meter. This is not good. Really not good. This is the, the smell. But the owner of this newsstand has it worse. Piles of debris surround his stand day in and day out, and he's fed up. It's uh, terrible. It is, it is not uh, acceptable. If the sanitation department are the working properly, so it is not possible. It should be clean. On a tour of the West Village, CBS2 cameras found uncollected garbage on block after block. So I called Sanitation Commissioner Edward Grayson. People say it's an eyesore. I would agree with them, and it's absolutely an eyesore. Grayson blamed the piles on a number of problems, including people not following pickup schedules. But having said that... We can certainly divert a resource to come. So what we now have to do is take this in, like we would normally do, as a complaint of an eyesore or a dump-out condition, and then just dispatch a crew to come and service this. Commissioner Grayson also listened to the newsstand owner's gripes and promised to have his teams do a better job of picking up the trash surrounding his business. Didn't fall on deaf ears, and I thank you for the feedback. Unfortunately, it's not just the garbage. The West Village has become a trifecta of quality of life problems. There's a big homeless problem. The manager of Papaya Dog says a few weeks ago a homeless man threw a brick through the window doing $1,000 worth of damage. We called the police, and, but I just saw the guy yesterday. He's not arrested. And then there is the graffiti. It's everywhere. A proliferation of colors and designs on walls, storefronts, newsstands, and mailboxes. Residents blame it on the mayor. He doesn't want the streets. He doesn't know what's going on. He could stay up on his high horse all he wants, but if people need help and nobody's doing it, then he's not doing a very good job. It's pretty sad. Uh, I wish it would get better. Honestly, it's a problem. I do not feel safe. Mayor de Blasio says things will get better when his cleanup corps starts working. But not everybody believes him. In the West Village, I'm Marcia Kramer, CBS 2 News.